So you've decided to pimp out your throne in Valheim, huh? Well, you have came to the right place, because today I'm going to be showing you three super simple and sexy throne designs that you can make in Valheim, starting with the secret throne right here. So I'm going to go ahead and use the black marble throne. I'm going to put down two because we're going to make a gall throne right after this one. So to make this one, all you're going to need is a seeker brute trophy and a seeker soldier trophy. And we're going to face the vertical item stand nipple in and put it right below the crest of the black marble throne. And then we're going to flip one around, nipple out, and place it about midway down the throne. Now we're going to come back and put the Seeker Soldier trophy on top. And as you can see, it clips right through, getting the tusks about midway. And then we're going to stick the Seeker's wings on the bottom, giving us this gnarly Seeker throne. Super easy, two trophies, two trophy stands, and you have yourself this badass throne like this one right here. But moving on to the next throne, not as cool as the Seeker throne in my opinion, but still a contender. We're going to go ahead and throw an item stand right up on the top. And since these gall trophies are a little tall, you are going to need to place this one up a little high. And then we're going to mount the gall trophy right on top. And we kind of have like his tendrils hanging down into the seat, which is kind of cool. It gives you like a robe effect. Now we're going to take the horizontal item stands and make sure that the nipple is facing the back of the chair. So we have the blank side towards us and we're going to place it right under the furs on the armrests. And this is going to be where we mount our two tick trophies. So two tick trophies, one gall trophy, and you have yourself this awesome gall throne. And I feel like it's missing something on the sides. I did spears, I did scepters, and it still wasn't right. Let me know down below if you know what needs to be on the side of this throne. Because I feel like it's missing just something. But moving on to the last throne, we're going to do the overgrown abomination throne. Now this one requires three stands and three abomination trophies. And we're going to start off, we're going to face nipple in and put one up top. And then we're going to caddy corner two more vertical item stands right down here at the bottom. And then we're going to take our three abomination trophies and tag them on. And as you can see, the abomination trophy sticks off of the stand a little bit. And that's why we're putting them down there. So the vines will kind of stick through the armrests. And then we stick one on top. And then you have this awesome gnarled up throne like so. Which that looks so awesome for the little amount of work that you have to put in to make it. I mean, take it to note, the first custom thrones I did used to take like 60 to 70 horizontal and vertical item stands to complete so this is a league ahead of that for simplicity but hey if you guys made it this far you must have enjoyed so don't forget to like comment do all that good stuff and if you need some valheim help don't forget to join the discord the link is in the description below and if you're in need of a valheim server don't forget to join the channel and then join the discord and with that said i'll catch you folks in the next one